guys, did you know it's 2015? Hey guys, so because it is 2015, I have decided to do a how to make 2015 your best year. And I've seen a, not a lot, but some people making this type of video where they're like, you know, make 2015 your year by eating clean, like eating healthy, exercising, organizing, decorating, all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to show you guys some of that stuff in this video. So let's get started. For this first DIY, it's a really cute picture frame that you can use as a cute uh, weekly planner type thing that I like to put on my wall. And it's a really cute decoration and it's help helpful for organizing and planning out your week. All you're going to need for this first DIY is any type of scrapbooking paper, a dry erase marker, some scissors, maybe a pencil, and a big picture frame. What I'm going to start by doing is taking the mat from the picture frame and just um, taping a bunch of white pieces of paper until it is 100% covered with white paper. You could definitely do whatever color you want, but I chose white and blue, and then I just cut out blue pieces of paper of different types of shapes, and then make sure you glue it or tape it down with the pencil lines facing down so of course you don't see them. And then that's what mine looked like, and then I just took some glass cleaner and it cleaned off of my glass frame, and then I put in the mat that we just made, and then I took a the backing and I just put on the backing and this is what it ended up looking like and it's a really cute way to plan your week. For the next DIY it's a really yummy way to stay healthy and it's a really yummy snack slash lunch whatever you want to have it for. All you're gonna need is bread, bananas, and peanut butter. You probably know what this is but I started off by taking my bread and popped in the toaster until it came out as toasted as you want it to be and then I just took some peanut butter and spread peanut butter on the bread and then I took a banana peeled it and cut it up into little slices and then I just placed those all over my bread or sandwich whatever you want to call it until you filled it up with bananas and this tastes so delicious I actually had it today for lunch and then I also had it as a snack all you're going to need for this delicious food snack thing is a water bottle some lemons or any types of fruit and then I just started off by rinsing off all of the ingredients. And then I sliced everything up. And I'm using strawberries and blueberries. And then I use lemon and oranges and cilantro. And I put them all into a cup. And just put everything in. And this is a really delicious detox water. And it just makes water taste so much better and it's really healthy for you because it has so many vitamins and nutrients in it and then I just put some water in there and then I let this sit in overnight and I used it the next day and it is delicious. This is a super cute DIY terrarium that's a really cute decor. You've probably seen it in my room decor video. If you haven't, go and check that out. But all you're going to need is like a vase, some sand, and some vase fillings. And I just layered some sand and like rocks or vase fillings, whatever you want, in this cute vase. And that's it. If you want to see me make it, go check out my room decor video. Yes, you have probably seen this on Pinterest, but it is a really cute save the change jar that is really good for organizing and managing your money, sort of. And all I did was tape a mason jar onto a mirror in my closet where I put away my laundry. And whenever you find some money inside of your pockets or whatever when you're putting away your clothes, you can just put it in there and then at the end of the month you can treat yourself with whatever. For some outfit ideas, I took just a plain purple tank top and matched them with these rainbow kind of bubble patterned leggings that I absolutely love. And then I also, for a second idea, I took these snowflake rainbow leggings and paired this with just this cream sweater that I had. For the last idea, I know it doesn't exactly match, but I took these blue plaid leggings with studs and paired it with this black and white striped shirt with a lace on the top and it doesn't exactly match but I love how cute it looks. For the first hair idea, this is if you have a little bit more time but I like to do a sock bun and tie a keychain bow on it. 
For the second idea, I like to call this the braid back or the twist back, and you can curl your hair before you do this if you want to, just to add a little bit more texture. But I just started off by brushing my hair, um, splitting or taking a small section in the front and braiding it, and then tying it off with an elastic. And then when you have two on each, one on each side, bobby pin each side back, and then you could also like twist your hair and bobby pin it back. The last idea, I'm just gonna kind of talk to you guys about it, but I'm not exactly gonna like show you it because it's not really something you can show. But um, I like to do this every morning where like I make a goal or like a workout to do and then just like a short five or ten minute workout and then I do that every morning and yeah it's just fun to stay healthy and yeah so that's and it. And also guys, oh camera shaking. And also guys if you want to know like where I get my workouts that I might do every day or like my stretches and stuff it's on an Instagram page called Live Fit Strong so I'll put it right here. And yeah, so it has a lot of good like daily workouts you could do for like a, or for the week or whatever. And yeah, they take me about five minutes to do each, and I just do those every morning. So yeah, if you want to check out their Instagram, it's called Live Fit Strong. So go check okay, it out. Okay, guys. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And also, um, this is one of the hair ideas. Um, I crimped my hair, and then I like twisted it back. So yeah, this is just an example of like crimping my hair while doing it but obviously they lost their wave but yeah so you can like crimp it or curl it and yeah so that's kind of some extras but if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to comment like and subscribe check out my instagram and all of my social medias which will be linked in the description box and that's it like this video with a thumbs up just because and i hope your 2015 is awesome and i'll see you guys next video bye